Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tyler. I'm a 2L at Columbia Law School, if you don't know. If you're not new here, welcome back. Yeah, today we are doing a day in the life video of a 2L. Uh, it's kind of like a week in the life because I recorded randomly over multiple days. So I only had classes Monday through Wednesday the last semester when I recorded this. So things are a little more front heavy and then I slowly stopped recording as the week got busier and busier because by Wednesday it felt like Friday and my brain was exhausted. But um, yeah, if you like these videos, videos, be sure to comment, let me know. I would be happy to make more of them. It seems like people really enjoyed the one L day in my life video. So yeah, would love to make more of these. Also hit that subscribe button if you're enjoying the content. I have my own um, little mission to try and get more subscribers than the Columbia Law School YouTube channel. So if we could all come together for that, that would be amazing. Yeah, but anyway, let's get into the video. So usually I start my day with reading for whatever I have for class, but I probably did that this morning and just didn't record it. And yeah, we start with a little outfit of the day, getting out the door, and I commute to school so that way I can get my things done. I've gotten it down to like a science at this point on the subway where I know exactly what train car I need to get into so I can get off at that same exit. You know, and if you enjoy these types of shots, I actually post on my Instagram story like every Wednesday a commute with me where it's just fun shots of my commute, random things I see on the street, and also the music I'm listening to. So if you're interested in that type of stuff or looking for new music, feel free to follow me. And then we get off of the subway and head towards main campus where I always run into my statue bay. He welcomes me to the campus every day when I go to class, which is always nice to see. Shout out to the green and the nice weather. Um, they're obviously from last semester, so it was just so much nicer and honestly it makes me so excited to hopefully have that warm weather come back, but you know, you'll see. Oh, there I am, I guess, had to eventually include myself in the video. Too many millennial peace signs are gonna be thrown in this video. And yeah, I mean, you can tell it's like the beginning of the semester, everyone's getting orientated. It's so pretty and I miss it. <laughs> so hopefully that'll come back soon. But it's a nice walk across the beautiful main campus um, and then we will eventually get to the much less beautiful law school building. You know, but at least you get to enjoy the walk while you're heading to class, so. There's that. Here we are, you can tell the gate, we're getting closer to the law school building, which many people on Instagram say looks like a brutalist type of jail. This side's not as bad, honestly. The statue's a little scary, but you know, the plaza above the street is always kind of fun. People go out there, especially when the weather's nice to like sit and chat. I'm just heading towards campus. I didn't have classes until after lunch this semester. So, you know, I'm heading to the school. I'm heading to a meeting first, honestly. Yeah, so I made it to the law school building. Always got to swipe in. Yeah, and there's my glorious lunch you know I honestly don't mind the pizza lunch when it's not like every single day but and then I head to class so this is my first class um, of the week it was info privacy which was a really enjoyable class honestly I tried to film without other students or people there obviously because I didn't want to get people's permission and you know and it's just like weird I think <laughs> for them to be on camera but um, yeah just sitting through lecture taking notes being studious my necklace says ambitious which is actually from a jewelry company one of my friends from undergrad made so I like to rep her stuff because it's really fun and then I am I'm hanging out with one of my mentees. So this semester I was a peer mentor. Um, I mean, I guess this whole year, but yeah, just taking shots of the campus, hanging out with friends in between classes, things like that. Grabbing coffee, obviously when it's needed. There she is, my mentee, she's the best. My second class of the day was a lot later in the evening. So, um, you know, it was what it was, but it was a really interesting FDA course. So really enjoyed that. And then yeah, after class, I make the same walk back to campus and commute back to my apartment. I don't record much in the class because I think that is a little weird, but um, you know, whatever. <laughs> it's like, what else is going on? Um, yeah, but it's it's so nice this time of day, walking across, the sun is going down, and um, it just feels a lot quieter on campus, so it's nice to decompress as I get back towards home. Another peace sign, I'll have to break that habit one day. And then heading back to the subway, as I said, you know, I, <laughs> I walk all the way down the platform so I know exactly where I need to, like which subway car to get onto, so that way I can, get off at the exact exit. I don't know what it is about that, but it's just become part of my routine, so. I'll also say the Columbia stop is so much nicer than so many of the other ones, it's ridiculous. And then I'm getting off the subway and I made it back to the elevator, my apartment. So this part, I'm always very sweaty from carrying my backpack and stuff, but just happy to be home at this point. I usually don't have work after class. When I get home from class, I try to just chill, but today I had to get some things done for the next day so whether it's like readings for class tomorrow or starting i had a lot of research this semester so you know papers research writing drafting editing things of that nature i did a lot of so yeah i had to put in some extra work this evening but usually i try to do all my work in the morning so that way uh, in the evenings when i'm back from class especially a later class like this i can just hang out but 
that is not the case today. Also, it's funny because I changed the layout of my apartment a little bit, so even though this is like the same shot, <laughs> instead of it looks different. <laughs> Also, you can see my Pure Mentor shirt. I just like am fully lounging back at home. Whenever I get home, I look like such a bum. And out in public too, most of the time, but whatever. After all that work, I just went to sleep. You know, usually I'll like watch TV or chill, but because I had work, I probably was just tired, so. So it's the next day. This is very typical for how I start all of my days. I wake up, I shower, didn't record that part because I'm not doing that. Um, and then I make a coffee, you know, make breakfast. I've been on, still on an oatmeal kick. If you watch the last uh, day in my life vlog, I made oatmeal. There was a part of the year where I was going through a toast phase, but I don't know, back on oatmeal, it's just easy and mindless. So I make my morning coffee and then I will get into my reading and work for whatever I have to do for the day. Wow, the way I left that steam wand in the way, ruining such an aesthetic shot. Yeah, so coffee's made, another peace sign. I don't know what to say about that. And then getting into my work. So yeah, as I said, in the mornings, it's usually just reading. I'm not writing as much unless it's a weekend or something, but in the mornings, I just try to get everything I need to get done for class done. I only have one class on this day, so I have a good amount of time. I don't have to get to campus until after lunch. So it's like a pretty chill, slow morning. I'm usually bumming it in that Columbia sweatshirt. No matter what time of year it is, it's usually cold in the apartment. So getting distracted for sure. I definitely take breaks and just twirl around in my chair <laughs> when I'm tired of reading or just need a little break. I can feel, yep, there's another peace sign. And then after I finish my readings, um, I've been trying to go back to the gym more. So went to the gym, trying to prioritize my health a little more, showing off my leg tattoos, I guess. Yeah. And then I get ready for school. So those earrings are also from my same friend who has the jewelry brand. I'll put it in the description, but just bumming it to school today. Nothing too crazy. From this video, it seems like most of my life is just me walking down subway platforms, which is not totally incorrect. And we're back on the subway. Always fun. I love when the subways are empty because then I can film without feeling weird. Also great staging. Someone just left their uh, <laughs> their food and drinks or whatever's in there. Very, very classic. And then we've made it back to Columbia. Uh, this class had such a great view. This is actually the view from my classroom. I'd never had a class in this building and especially not on such a high floor. So I definitely took advantage and tried to show you all <laughs> what that was like. I remember the first day, this probably was near the first day of class, I was so shocked at just all the buildings and you can essentially see over all of Harlem um, and over Morningside Park from this view. So it was a really, really cool place to have class once a week. Yeah, and then that class was three hours long. So, you know, from these clips, you can't really tell, but heading back across campus after class. And then this is the last day. And then after that, I probably went and just like hung out at home. But again, I didn't really record that because when I'm sitting in my own apartment, I'm not really recording. So I'm making dinner or like whatever, or like my partner's making dinner, like whoever, or we're picking up food. So like I said, at this point in the week, I'm like pretty exhausted. So it just is what it is, but on to Wednesday. Now you can see made the toast. Yep. Instead of oatmeal today, we went for the toast vibe. Always just a black iced Americano. I don't know what I'm doing with this toast. Why am I shooting a shot like this? But yeah, but this morning, um, sometimes I'll watch like YouTube videos or whatever and just chill. But today I think I was just stressed because I had to go to the court in the Bronx. So just mentally preparing for the day ahead. <laughs> you can tell I'm like really tired at this point. And then another outfit check. Some people don't like this green suit. I personally really like it, mostly because it's comfortable and it's not just like a boring suit, but you know, whatever. Go off in the comments if you don't. The final peace sign. And then this commute, I am heading towards the Bronx. So uh, I'll be heading to the Bronx court and wrapping up. But you know, as I said, I really stopped recording essentially because one, I can't record in the court and it's, you know, I'm working with clients. So like I said, I was taking a little less classes, working more with clients. So that stuff I just couldn't record, but you know, hopefully this was an interesting video for you. If you're interested in attending Columbia, you can kind of see like, this was not a really exceptional day slash week in my life. It was pretty normal. Like, <laughs> you know, there's definitely other weeks I could record where it's like lots of events or dinners or whatever you're going to. Um, but I just wanted to show you kind of what a normal week slash day in the life is like. You know, it's it's law school. Sometimes people like to glamorize it, but it really it's school at the end of the day for me. And um, I also didn't want to like over record me studying or things like that. Like I'm not a library person. I like to work from home. I'm also the type of person, like I said, I make set times. I'm reading in the morning. I'm not like reading all throughout the night. Um, I think it's healthy to have a balance and I'm not really the like grind productivity type of person who's like, you always need to be grinding. Like I think rest is really important. I think taking time for yourself is really important because you know, otherwise you really can't perform at your best when you need to. So um, I think just 
being 100% all the time is not necessary. And yeah, so hopefully this video just gives you an insight on what it's like to just have a normal week in the life. If you have any questions or would like to see more of these videos, feel free to comment. As I said, I have my goal of beating Columbia Law School's subscriber count. <laughs> so if you want to join me in that petty journey, um, please, please do. I welcome as many people as possible just because I think that's super funny. Yeah, and I look forward to making more videos in the future. If you have any questions, comments, DM me. My socials are in the description below and I'll see you in the next video. Another peace sign <laughs> at this point. Bye.